Hi there, everyone. I sure hope you're doing okay. I just want to share a quick thought this morning that just gripped me and I wanted to pass it on to you. Um, in Genesis chapter 12, there's a statement and it says, Now Yahweh says to Abram, leave it all behind. God spoke to Abraham and told him, leave it all behind. Leave it all. Now Abraham was a very, very rich man. He had quite a bit of um, possession, quite a bit of position. He was um, an, uh, an amazing man in his own right. And God said, nope, it's time to take what you know, Abe, and leave it behind. I've got something new for you. I want you to go to a land that I'm going to show you. I'm not going to even tell you the name of it. I just want you to go and trust me, and I'll show you what to do in that land. Abraham did. Here's the thought, though, that comes with some of that meaning. God just wasn't asking Abraham to leave behind his past and his old ways. He was asking Abraham to step out into a whole new venture and discover a whole new self. He was asking Abraham to follow him, God, and God would reveal Abraham's true character, true purpose, and true fulfillment. But Abe had to leave behind his past understanding. He had to leave behind his past thoughts. He couldn't box in God the way he had boxed in his thoughts and ideas and plans. And Abraham was blessed. He's now called the father of our faith because he chose to follow God's voice. And to me and to you, the challenge is just that. God is calling us to leave the comfort of what we once knew, to follow and trust him in a dimension that we've never, ever walked before, but to find a new identity, a new purpose, a new richness inside of us. God is calling us to leave behind the past so that we can break out of expectations and into the new, wonderful fulfillment of every promise he has for us. I want to follow like Abraham did. And I thought maybe you would too. Have a great day.